says upcoming. Oh, live chat one person. Yeah. Okay. Hello. So today I'm just gonna be um doing my twin sister's nails. I already went ahead and um did the like nail extension. So they're kind of just clear right now. So I'm just gonna decorate them and um, let you guys watch. I have right here some samples of the colors that I have. So we're gonna be doing like a mix of like this purple, a pink, this like a glittery see-through purple, and then like a glitter pink and top coat. So um, cool. So yeah, we'll go ahead and get into it. I'm gonna do every nail or each nail a little bit different. So I think I'm going to be using, I have a bunch of different stickers here. I have like um, no Face and Suit Sprites, some Sparkles, some Hello Kitty, um, different Sanrio ones. But I think for today what I want to do is uh, Karomi Nails. Oh, I even have Sailor Moon. So I'm going to do some of these Karomi stickers and I think I'm going to use the ones with the purple from the Sundir Cafe theme. So I'm going to put those aside for now and um, I'm just going to start... The, um, painting her nails first, do the base, and then I'll do like rhinestones and like little accessories. Okay, so I think I'm gonna start with one hand at a time. I usually like to do one hand at a time. So I'm gonna do her, um, this hand, which is her left hand, I believe. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna start with her thumb, and I think I'm gonna do like opaque pink and then a glitter, and then an opaque, and something like that. So I'm going to start with this pink, and I'm going to do this now here. And I have a UV lamp here that I'm going to be using to um, cure the um, gel. I'm doing gel nail polish, because I feel like the gel cures um, faster and easier. So I like to use gel over um, just like regular nail polish. Is the music loud? Let me get, let me know if you guys think the music is kind of loud. I don't know if it's too loud. All the colors are beautiful. I love your video. Thank you. So I'm just going to go straight in and paint um, the pink one. And this one will need a couple of coats because it's kind of like a light, like sheer-ish kind of pink. So don't get alarmed that the first coat looks like kind of um milky streaky. or streaky so 
So how's your guys' day? I hope you guys are having a good Monday. It's Monday, right? Yeah, I believe it's Monday. Monday. So that's the first coat. I'm gonna go ahead and um, just work on the rest before I cure that. And then that way she can cure the whole hand together. So the next finger, I'm gonna do like a glitter. Oh, I grabbed the purple glitter when I really wanted the pink glitter. I'm gonna do like a pink glitter. That one's really glittery. We might only need one coat of that one. Can you read any of them? Oh, yeah. The volume is just right and I'm good. How about you and your sister? We're pretty good as far as Mondays go. Um, this is just what we've been doing so far. Yeah, I'm having a good Monday too. I woke up kind of late, but it's a good day so far. Don't let the nail touch the mat. Okay. And Hi, Mitsuri. And then I'm going to do purple glitter for the next nail. I think the glitter nails are only going to need one coat, but I'm going to go in with two coats for the um, opaque colored nails. For us, it's 3.46 p.m. We're in um, Los Angeles. So then I'm gonna just repeat the pattern and do the pinky in that same light pink color. What time is it for all of you guys? How long do the nails stay on? I think that really depends what technique she's using. Um, the way she did them today is a little different and so they should last like how, how do you know I would say like um well it really depends like I, it would last until put them in here I'm gonna cure this layer now for 60 you can do 30 to 60 seconds it really depends on um how you wear them like these I'm most likely not gonna remove them I'm gonna keep them on her and then next week I'll just file off the design and then fill in the um the growth so they're kind of like these where i have like a little growth already so what i'll do is um take off the rhinestones and then use an e-file or electric file to file off the color and then fill in the empty space and then do a new design again oh wow for a lot of people it's actually super late it's 6 47 7 47 or 8 47 for most people that's really cool that's really interesting for some people it's even tuesday <laughs> Oh shoot, <laughs> that's cool. Are they dip or acrylic? These are actually gel, they're like um, gel X. So they're like, um, like a gel nail extension. So now that first layer is cured, I'm gonna go in now and um, put a second layer on the opaque colors. I just woke up from a nap. That, that sounds, sounds nice. Mean. Yeah, I was gonna say the same thing. That sounds really nice. Did we get my monster? No, let me go get it. I left it in the freezer. Once I do this now, I'll go get it. Oh, thank goodness someone reminded us with the nap comment because I would have left it in there. Someone said I heard gel X is better for your nails. Oh. I think it's much better than acrylic because when I used to have acrylic nails, oh, that's true. that was like horrible for my nails. Let it kind of set. Yeah, you know what? I think it is better for your nails because I feel like, I don't know if you can tell, but like your nails grow a lot underneath. And if you wanted to take it off, all you do is kind of file it down and your nails are still really healthy and long underneath. So I would say that the like gel X nail extensions are probably better for your nails. Yeah, we'll do more lives of the phone cases and packaging and stuff. Today's not a day for us to package, but as soon as um, 
another packages, packaging day comes up, we can do another live. You guys really do love monster drinks. <laughs> yeah, I do, and Red Bull. Has anybody tried? Um, I don't know if you guys drink energy drinks or monster, but like the new pink one, the uh, Strawberry Dreams. It's my favorite one right now. So just hold it like that, kind of let it settle for like 10 seconds. I'm going to put it in here for the... Okay. I got your monster, it's cold. You can't stand energy drinks, it's too cold. I mean, it's too strong for you. It's I, I hear it's too strong for a lot of people. For some people, even a coffee is too strong. Yeah, our friend Oni, he always says the same thing. The caffeine like gets him kind of jittery, so I get it. So after that, I think we're gonna go ahead and decorate the nails. I got these little like tiny bows, like iridescent little bows, and I think I'm gonna put these on her nails and then maybe some rhinestones. They give you anxiety, but for some reason you can drink Red Bulls. I think that's because Red Bulls have less caffeine than like Monster Energy, or I think Rockstar has even more than that. But yeah, that's why I like Red Bulls too, like, because they don't have as much right caffeine, so I can drink more of them in a day. So, I mean, you think that's opaque enough? Or do you think it needs like a third? Oh, I think it's perfect. It's really pretty. I feel like that's you can show them. So I'm going to put the colors aside, and then we're going to do these stickers now. And then the 3D stuff. This is the top coat. And just to go over, if you guys are wondering, the colors we used for the pink, it's this one from Amazon. And I'll link it in the video when I'm done. In color 19. Um, the purple is from, it says Nail Addict, but they changed their name to LA, LA Nail Reserve. And this one is Breaking News. And then these I got on Amazon. They're from Your Sugar. And I'll link the, um, these are the glitter ones. I'll link them in the description for you guys. Someone said, I wish Red Bull had sugar-free coconut flavor. That's my favorite. They actually do. I just have never seen it around here, mm -hmm. but you can order it online. I recently ordered a four-pack to try it, and it's actually not as good as the regular coconut. It tastes a lot different. I was so disappointed because I ordered them thinking it would taste the same, just sugar-free, but it wasn't, like, the same. So, stickers. I'm going to do these stickers and they're really thin so you want to be careful when you peel them up but i'm going to use some tweezers and kind of peel them up so we have the heart eyes and the non-heart eyes which one do you want on the middle and which one this is the i middle. think heart eyes should go on the heart eyes is smaller so maybe yeah, in the one. middle Let's put this one here. Do you want it facing me or facing you? It, whatever you think is better. <laughs> How do you guys do it? Like when you do a design, do you have the design facing you or facing out? Yeah, because when I do the design, I always do it facing out. But then Kid B, she always wants her design facing her. Yeah, because I want to be able to see it, you know? So, I and think same I'm... thing with our rings. I always have my rings facing me and Jerry tends to yeah. have them facing out. I'm going to do facing you, but I, I'm curious as to what they think. Um, does that look straight? I'm going to do Hi, it a Sunshine little bit Captain. higher like this because I think I'm going to put the bow right here. What oh, do you yeah. think? I don't know. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I moved. Hey, everyone. Thank you guys for still being here with us. Okay, so that's how it looks with the stickers on. But I think now what I want to do is the ones that don't have um, glitter, I want to put a little bit of glitter on the tips. So the purple one, I'm going to grab the purple glitter. 
and I'm just going to put a little bit on the tip like that. And then I'm going to use a little brush and kind of pull it down to kind of fade it down. Just so that there's a little bit of glitter at the top. Where did you get the nail stickers? I'm living for them. These, I believe I got them on AliExpress or Amazon. I can link them for you guys in the description. When I'm done with the video, I'll link everything that I put. You think that's enough glitter? Yeah, that's so cute. I can't see on my... Yeah, so I'm going to add some glitter to the pink ones then. I don't want to do too much. Is the picture quality okay for you guys? Sometimes when I notice that the quality isn't so good, I'll go to the settings and make sure that it's on a higher uh, picture quality. Because usually for lives, for me at least when I'm watching them, it sets it at like a really low quality. Oops. <laughs> you know what I just realized? That on this one, I wanted to put a sticker too. I think I wanted to use these stickers. Let me see the nail, see what fits. Hi, Kaylin. Hi, Noemi. Yeah, I think I'm going to use like a hollow heart. Uh, quality is pretty okay, set to 720. Okay, thank you. Yeah, I think that's about the quality I have mine set to. For some reason, whenever a live starts, um, for me, the quality is like at 200, 250, or 240. Like something like that, I think. That's perfect. Yeah, that's perfect. I got a little fiber stuck in it. We'll live. <laughs> I wiped it with the like alcohol wipe after. Okay, so cure that for like a few seconds. Will you open my one stick? <laughs> yes. A uh, random fact about me, Kitty, is that um, I hardly ever have my drink straight from the can or the bottle. I always pour my drink over ice. But this one's really cold and I don't have ice. So, I'll just drink it out of the can, but I usually don't like to do that. I always drink my, have my drinks at, like, over ice. So, since I got it, kind of, like, this layer is kind of, um, sticky and tacky, and I accidentally got a little bit of, um, like, a little fiber on it. I'm going to wipe it off with the alcohol wipe before we do the top coat. I think the purple on the side, I missed a little bit. You probably don't mind, but I'm gonna put a little Where, bit the more. glitter? Yeah. That's fine. Like on the side here, it's kind of missing a little bit of glitter. <laughs> Twisting my fingers all crazy just so you can see it. I'm sorry. <laughs> this doesn't hurt. No, it's me. Like. <laughs> Cure that for like a little bit. Um, next, I think I'm going to glue the little bows and some rhinestones. So let me get some nail glue. gonna be using this glue from KISS, it's Powerflex Pink Nail Glue, and I'm gonna use this to glue down the little bows and rhinestones. Hi Kaylin, thank you. So uh, what time is it here? It's your first time watching? Hi Manu, thank you for joining us. It's actually 4.02 p.m. here. We're in Los Angeles. 
Are those my natural nails? No, these are not. These are um, gel um, extension nails. Thank you, Caillou. So I think what I'm going to do is use this little purple um, bow on her thumbnail, like here. And then I'm going to do rhinestones on the glitter nails. Should we do pink rhinestones or AB? Pink. Hello, Kyle. Hi, Alyssa. So I'm going to be using these pink rhinestones. And I'm going to apply the glue right to her nail, like that. I kind of blow on it a little bit just to get it sticky. And then I'm going to use this nail tool. It's got like wax on one side and a little pointer on the other side. And I'm going to use the wax to pick up the bow and just drop it into the glue like that. Someone is asking what type of nail polish you use that hardens under the UV light. Oh, it's called gel nail polish. So any, um, if you find G-E-L, like this, gel polish, that will harden under the um, UV light. And I prefer that over um, regular nail polish because you don't have to wait for it to dry so long. And I feel like it lasts a lot longer too. Mm -hmm. It doesn't chip as easily. Thank you, Ayasumi. Uh, do you have your own nail business or no? No hearts, we don't. We actually have a different type of business, but today we're doing nails. Jerry does uh, her nails and my nails for me as well. My name's Kitty. Yeah, and we just do it for fun, like a hobby. Caillou wants to know how often do you guys change your nails? You always have the cutest nails in your videos. Thank you so much, Caillou. Um, it really depends, like, how much work we're doing. <laughs> how busy we are. Yeah, what type of work. But I say we don't usually have the same uh, set for more than, like, a week, usually. Yeah, I would say, like, a week. These I've had for, like, a week and a half, and they're grown out and stuff. So I wanted to change them last night, but I got busy. So I'm probably going to change them out tonight or tomorrow. Hi, Malek. Glad you could join. Hey, Allison. Can I straighten it like that? Thank you. That looks good on both. So I kind of just put like a little dot of this glue and then picked up the rhinestone with this tool and dropped it down, moved it to where I wanted. And now I'm gonna like just wait for them to dry. And once they're nice and dry, then I'm gonna go and take the top coat. And I'm gonna be using this one by McCart. It's really good, I really like this one. I got it on Amazon, I'll link it for you. And when everything's dry, I'm gonna seal everything with um, a couple coats of this top coat. You only really need one coat if you're just doing colors, but I noticed that with the stickers, it's best to do two coats because then the stickers really don't like lift at all. Thank you, Phoenix Hellfire. Hi, Michelle. Thank you, Michan. Lil Snooky says, we must shop at Amazon a lot because most of the things you have, I have for my nails too. Oh, yeah, <laughs> we both. I think Amazon's a pretty cool place to get um, nail supplies. Yeah, they have like affordable nail supplies and then you get them fast, so. I like Amazon for nail supplies personally. I recently got some nail supplies on Shein. I, guys, how do you say Shein? I say Shein, and she says Shein. It's Shein, isn't it? Anyways. And she says like Shein. We all know what we're talking about, but yeah, I recently got some nail supplies on Shein that I'll show you guys. I I just didn't bring them today. <laughs> yeah, because you just want me to use my stuff. <laughs> um, someone said, oh my god, where's the adorable place? place mat from oh this mat it's from ally express i can link it for you guys too i have a lot of these um these little mats i really like them because they're easy to clean and i use them for um crafting nails like on my desk for everything turns out you're right jerry someone said it's she in la fada they just posted recently i told you <laughs> i'm gonna still call it she in <laughs> no she in um like she's in hey lele sweets 
I never did long nails. Can you work the comfort board, do the dishes, or maybe use the phone? I'm curious to try. The phone is the harder part, I'm not gonna lie, because the nails kind of get in the way when you're wanting your, the skin on your finger to touch the phone. The nails do get in the way, especially your thumbs. Um, but it's doable. You just type with like the side of your fingers, you adapt. But uh, I don't, I personally don't have a problem like crafting or doing dishes and cleaning though. Like I do the dishes a lot, every day obviously. <laughs> And, um, like, the rhinestones and stuff don't really fall off. Phoenix says she says they say it the way, um, I say it as well. <laughs> um, this makes me want to do my own nails. It looks fun, and you make it look so easy. Jerry does make it look easy. But, honestly, it really isn't, isn't, uh, too difficult. It is pretty easy once you're used to it. The big piece is dry already, but the two small rhinestones are kind of not completely dry. But I'm gonna, since I'm doing double coats on the sticker ones, I'm gonna go ahead and do the first coat on all the sticker ones. And she actually has a few nail video like tutorials on our YouTube account if you guys are curious, like how oh, she yeah. did the nail and everything, or you wanna see more um, nails that she's done, we have some videos up. Yeah, I do have some videos up from like the beginning of the process to the end if you want to see how everything was done. And yeah, we don't have a nail salon. We don't sell nail supplies or anything like that. We just do it for fun. Kitty, where do you get your rings? Um, I get them in lots of different places. This one right here is a coffin. And I got the this coffin from coffingems.com. And they have different like designs with different size coffins. And I think this is the, the th no, this is the five carat size coffin. And it's in the color ghost, which is just clear. They have an Instagram too, Coffin Gems. You can see all of their different designs. I actually watched one recently. It's the one with the Karomi nails. Yeah, that's my favorite nail. She's done the Karomi nails. Are you guys surprised that I'm doing Karomi nails today? I, I am. I'm surprised. <laughs> when you said that you wanted to do Karomi, I was really surprised. I just wanted to do something fun, and I think she looks really cute in the, like, Lolita outfit. But I didn't want too much black, so I told her just go with pink and purple. Because, <laughs> like, I think in the Karomi video you did, yours, you had black. Like, black and purple, huh? Yeah, I always do black. Like, a little black. So cure those for me. Put in the lamp. Yeah. Long nails make my hands look so dainty and cute, but I can't have them long because I work in the food industry. Yeah, Caillou, mm -hmm. I feel you on that because um, I was just telling Jerry that I like my nails really long because it makes my fingers feel like longer. That's what you were saying. Because yeah. I have really small hands and I don't like how small my fingers are. Have you girls ever seen the Yo Woo headphones? Are those the ones with like, they have the cat ear ones, the card captor ones, and I think they have the earbuds with the elf ears? If so, yeah, I think those are really cool. They have like this baby blue like rem from, uh, Anime Zero? From ReZero headset. Oh, I it's haven't beautiful. seen it. It's got like a, in the headphones, it's got the little design that she has. The, like on her headband, on her the headband, white yeah. flowers? Yeah. Right here. But I like, haven't seen that. It's gorgeous. Ladies, try okay. working on your own nails with small nail beds. It took me four years to perfect my nails. Oh, you saw the rim ones? Yeah, they're really cute. So now I'm going to do a second top coat on all the um, sticker ones and then the first top coat on the rhinestones. Phoenix said, yes, those are the ones. I have three, black, gold, and pop mark purple ones. Oh, how cool. She has three of the um, Yowu headsets. Oh, no um, way. Phones. Would Headphones. you say that they're worth purchasing? Yeah, like, do you like the quality of them? The Yowu headphones are a dream. Oh, my God, I regret not getting the card captor Sakura one. That's someone else. Ah. Oh. I've been following that account for a while now. I love their um, headphones. And the, the elf ear buds, so cool. 
I have to get those, huh? The elf yeah, the elf ear buds, you need those. Does anyone else here do their own nails? Or do you um, guys get your nails done? Or you haven't tried doing nails yet? <laughs> hey, oh my god, lives back to back. I'm still catching up with the others. Love your content, proud of you, and I'm grateful. Right now I am busy, but I'll rewatch the live. Thank you so much, Kikuyana. I hope I said that right. Ki or Kai Ku Kuyana? Marie, really beautiful name, by the way. And thank you, thank you for watching our content. Hi, Barbara, hey. Thank you. Okay, now we can cure these. Go ahead, put them in the lab. Uh, Serena says, yes, I always do mine. Going to a salon is so expensive, isn't it? And uh, yeah. time consuming. That was the part I hated the most, is sitting there for so long. Yeah, I used to get, we used to get our nails done together all the time. We would always do a joint appointment. That was mm -hmm. so funny, like next to each other sit next to each other and um the the price is one thing especially when like your nails grow so fast like kitty and mine we ha we have to do fills like every week but the worst part is the like how time consuming it is it takes like a lot out of your day mm -hmm. uh i do my nails but not permanent i do it with common nail polish me too i own a lot of regular nail polish yeah you use a lot of regular nail polish i don't have yeah. the patience for it yeah jerry only does gel nail polish but i use regular nail polish my sister did my nails once, but because of my anxiety, I picked them off in less than a week. That's Jerry. Yeah, my husband always makes fun of me. And he's like, oh, how long are these going to last you before you pick them off? Uh, Our Lady says, I usually just use regular polish, but I've been thinking about trying gel. Definitely try gel. Because I use regular nail polish, and Jerry uses the gel. And it's so much better because, honestly, regular nail polish takes so long to dry. They have It's cheaper, and they have better and funner colors in the regular nail polish, but it just takes too long to dry. And then you end up running them. Yeah, the camera's shaking a little. Oh, it is. Oh. That was you, probably. Thank, yeah, that was me. Thank you. I think they're you're so done. cute. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, don't be scared to mess up. Um, you can um, just get nail polish remover and clean them up. Where's the nail file? That white one. I've actually seen a lot of people do their nails that way. Like, um, if you feel like you're doing it a little messy, it's fine. Just clean it up with it um, a side. brush and some nail polish remover. Like the parts that get on your skin and you'll be okay. Barbara said, I like sometimes using regular nail polish then putting a gel top coat on top yeah, to make them that's last longer. Smart. That's a smart idea. She's smart. <laughs> <laughs> I go to the salon to do my feet. I need to go, so thank you for reminding me. I can't because, okay, interesting fact, Jerry speaking here, I have extremely ticklish feet and I don't like anybody touching my feet, so I have to do my own pedicures. My husband really makes fun of me a lot for that one. Little Snooky said I stopped going because I hate getting off at 6 p.m. Most places close at 7. Yeah, my nail oh. appointments were always super early and I didn't love that. <laughs> okay, you can show them now. Show them off, they're completely done. Oh, okay, so this is how they turned out. Did every nail a little bit different. Hopefully it's focusing. Maybe in the, I don't know. Hopefully you guys can see. I like this one. I use regular nail polish, but it chips off in like two days. That's me. That's how I feel. I'm like, I do dishes once and the nail polish is all chipped off. I don't know if you guys can see the design really well, but I'll take a picture after the live and post it in the um, community tab so you guys can um, see better. Phoenix says that they just go with their mom to get their, um, watch her do their, her nails while they um, play on their Switch because they did it once and hated it. Yeah. Also, yeah. sometimes people are kind of rough. Yeah, I think so too. They're beautiful, they're beautiful. Thank you guys so much for all the compliments. I love them too. There's a train passing. I'm so lucky to have Jerry to um, do my nails for me. 
Okay, so should we do... We have to do the other hand, which I'm going to do the same way. Should we do it off? Yeah, but I think maybe first we should do lunch and then we should... <laughs> yeah, we okay guys, eight. so we're going to do the next hand exactly the same. Like with the same stickers and everything. So... We're going to have lunch first though, and then I'm going to have her do my nails. And if you guys want to see how it came out, like with both hands, I'm going to post them on Instagram. So if you guys don't follow us on Instagram, our main account is Dreamy Craft Shop. But our personal account is kitty.goes.meow. Um, yeah, at kitty.goes.meow. I think there's a link in our Dreamy Craft Shop bio. And then I'll post like some um, videos and show you guys how they came out. But um, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, are they gel nails? Yes. Um, one left my cuticles bleeding. Yeah, it's horrible sometimes. Uh, you guys should try the 3D modeling gel. Fun for making your own little charms. Oh, when they have those tiny I've little molds. I've seen those. We really yeah, need to try those. Yeah, that's so cute. I, want, I saw someone make like a Kirby. I thought that was so cute. Okay, well, thank you guys so much for um, being patient with us and watching us do this. We had a lot of fun. Like I said, um, don't forget to follow us on Instagram if you want to see. Or if you guys have some suggestions for next next week when I do my nails again, let us know. I think Jerry needs to change for soon. Yeah, I think I was going to do mine tomorrow. So if you guys want, want to see me do it, let me know. Okay, but that's all for today. I love you guys so much. See you in the next one. Bye.